Hi everyone, my name is Payal and I am currently pursuing integrated PhD at Indian Institute of Science, Bangalore. So in this video, I will be discussing about uh, some uh, colleges which you can apply after qualifying IIT Jam. Uh, like, of course, after IIT Jam, you can apply for IIT Jam counseling. Um, and uh, if you have scored enough, uh, like your rank is very good. So you'll be uh, getting the admission opportunity at IIT, IIT Bombay, IIT Delhi, etc. Uh, but apart from IITs, uh, please don't forget to apply for these colleges, which I'm going to discuss in this video. So let's proceed with the video. So here is a list of some uh, uh, institutes apart from the IITs, which you can get admission in which you can get admission after uh, qualifying IIT Jam. Uh, you have to apply separately uh, on their website. You will be eligible for the interview. And uh, in this video, I'll be discussing about the process, uh, how you can get into these institutes and uh, what will be the fellowship they will be providing? So let's start. So our most favorite institute, that Indian Institute of Science, ISC, it accepts to applications through JAM and GATE. If you want to get into two-year MSc Life Science program, there will be interview, but uh, you'll be not receiving any fellowship. For the integrated PhD program, it will the selection will be based on your overall academic progress. You should be JAM qualified. Uh, after qualifying JAM, you have to uh, apply on their website and uh, you'll be called for interview based on the cutoff rank. Fellowship will be 16,000 per month uh, for the first two years. After clearing the comprehensive examination, you'll be given uh, GRF and SR. Uh, the second institute in the list is uh, JNCSR, Bangalore. Uh, it also offers two programs, MSc program in inter interdisciplinary biosciences. CHAM should be qualified. You have to apply on their website. You will be shortlisted for the interview based on their criteria. No fellowship for the MSc program, but if you will apply for the in PhD, selection will be based on your overall academic progress online interview will be conducted after if you will qualify their online entrance test yes they do conduct an online entrance test even you have qualified jam or you can apply even uh, if you haven't uh, appeared for jam fellowship will be 19000 per month followed by srf and jr in the third year uh, and uh, you can also apply at icer kolkata uh, integrated PhD program uh, via JAM or TIFR. Interview will be conducted. They will uh, update a shortlist on their website. Fellowship will be 10,000 per month for the first two years followed by JRF and SRF. By the way, JRF amount is current JRF amount is 37,000 per month and uh, SRF amount is 42,000 per month. You can also apply a TICER TVM, that is Thiruvanthapuram. Uh, it also offers two programs in PhD. They will conduct a separate TVM entrance test. You need not to be qual uh, jam qualified or gate or anything. Interview will be conducted based on the performance in the TVM entrance test. Fellowship will be 10,000 per month, followed by JRF and SRF if you will join in PhD program. But for the MSc, TVM entrance test will be conducted. Interview will be there, but no fellowship will be provided. It is too... Uh, years long program apart from it you can also apply in uh, icer bpr that is icer dharampur uh, they offers in phd uh, you should be jam and differ qualified interview will be there fellowship of 12400 followed by srf and jerf you can also apply in uh, uh, icer mohali jam qualified you should be jam qualified they will release forms uh, after that they will uh, update our 
shortlist for the interview. After the interview, uh, if you will be selected, no fellowship for the first two years, but after clearing the comprehensive exam, from the third year onwards, you will be getting JRF and SRF. I think uh, they have they haven't mentioned uh, like they will they provide fellowship or not, but uh, they have written that uh, from the third year onwards, financial assistance will be provided. Apart from this, you can also apply at Iser Tirupati uh, Integrated PhD program in Biological Sciences. Uh, for this, you must have 6.5 CGP in your UG or 60% aggregate of percentage. They'll call you for the interview. Separate form will be released on their website. Stay tuned. Keep on checking these websites. Uh, if I get the info, I'll upload on. Uh, I'll upload as a community post, or uh, if possible, I'll be making a video. Financial assistance for the first two years, followed by GRF and SRF. Uh, for the ISER Bhopal MSc program is there in biological sciences only. Uh, uh, no in PhD so far. I found the information regarding it. Um, jam or you you for applying for the program you will be you must be jam or cat p qualified direct interview uh, based on this uh, jam or get b score or rank no fellowship for the MCO. apart from this you can apply at nicer bhuvneshwar also uh, you can apply in two year msc program in uh, medical radiological physics plus one year internship via jam or just or in PhD program uh, based on your uh, JG Wills or JAM. They'll call for the interview also. And apart from all this, there is a, a program in collaboration with the uh, ICT, I, IACS Kolkata and IIT Kharagpur. They offer a joint PhD MSc program in biological sciences. Uh, they started it in 2021. Uh, you must be jam qualified in order to apply for the interview. Uh, for the for the admission, they'll uh, call for the interview based on the what you have the information what you have provided in the uh, form. Uh, and if you'll be selected for this program, you'll be awarded twelve thousand per month uh, fellowship for the first two years and followed by JRF and SRF. So do apply in all uh, these colleges if uh, you want to get admission by a gem. Uh, apart from this, uh, go and uh, study for GATB also. Soon I'll be uploading a video uh, uh, about GATB also. So if you are not getting a good good marks or good rank, don't be, don't feel negative. Just uh, start preparing for GATB and apply in these institutes. Uh, the thing is that all these institutes will conduct an interview and you have to prepare for the interview as well. So, that's all about it. If you want any interview tips or uh, something, anyhow, I'll be uploading a video regarding interview tips. So, if you have, in case if you have any doubt, feel free to ask. Uh, wishing you a very great career ahead. Uh, thank you.